the beginning of October, and you know what that means. Spooky season! That includes tons of Dead by Daylight, tons of Three Scary Games, tons of the Spooky Games. I'm getting ahead of myself. Hey, yo, what's poppin'? Party people, I'm that one dude Chris from YouTube and welcome to Zucosis! Another game to add on to the list of games that I've been waiting for the release of for a hot minute. Another game I believe that was announced either during the Summer Game Fest or the Game Awards last year. One of those two, but I have had this game on my Steam wishlist for for quite some time and it it, it 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 appealed to me because as a kid i used to go to the zoo a lot for like field trips or just for family outings so what would it be like if those animals were infected by a virus that caused them to mutate and be dangerous more dangerous than they already are that is zucosis i, I think we're playing as a night security guard we have to rescue the animals by giving them antidotes or whatever i something like that i I don't know, but welcome to spooky season, y'all. I got my lights adjusted for Halloween themed, green and orange. You know what I'm saying? I, I, I think these things through. You know? <laughs> okay. All right. Without further ado, let's hop right into this shit. Before we begin, I want you to put down your scribble. Oh. Whoa. Oh. Okay. Non-disclosure agreement for Night Zoo <laughs> of Pine Valley Zoo. Night Zookeeper of Vine Pally Zoo. Definition of confidential. All right, hold on. You got to read all the terms of agreement before you sign anything. I'm going to sign anyway, so I don't know why it matters. Let's not waste time here. Hey, we'll hey. Here all night. Hey. Got more important things to attend to. Fine. Bitch, I'll sign. That is a horrible signature. Excellent. You made the right move. Just a couple more things and you'll pull your family out of poverty. I really hope so. Attach this to your chest. Our scientists require us to do this to see everything that happens in the enclosures. Scientists? I thought this was a zoo. True. Never thought that the smart Alex belong right in the zoo. <laughs> hope you got the joke. Excellent. Now let's get started. First, grab your personal PDA. It's necessary for interacting with all the work objects. Congratulations, you've taken the first step to becoming a part of our close-knit zoo family. Wait, what's this for? Oh my god! He'll find out later. Can I unsign the the agreement papers? Can I can I resign on my first day? <laughs> I hear that's a popular thing to do in retail. Oh, are you finally awake? Good, get up. It's time to get to work. What the hell? What did you do to me? I took care of your health. Working with animals requires prevention. You wouldn't want to bring some kind of infection home, would you? That's exactly what way, I want. I took your phone as well. I'll return it in the morning after the shift. <clears throat> hey, just don't so go th the job. Just don't go through my I photos. We had an interview. My wife is waiting for me outside. The job will be yours if you make it through the night. Let's go. I still have a lot to show you. Ooh! <laughs> okay, so this is a body cam horror game. There was like a little bit of a um, a warning that it may cause some discomfort for those who aren't used to that kind of visual style. I believe it said that this game contains nudity. I, I probably should turn that off in the... Yeah, let me go ahead and do that. It's already off. They thought of everything. W game. Either I'm short as shit, or this body cam is like sitting on my belly button. Cause why the hell is the toilet so low? <laughs> what the fuck? All right, I need to I need to stay focused. This is my locker. <gasps> I get overalls. Damn, that's fashion right there. Access denied. All right, sir, sir, please forgive me. I'm being a gamer. I just like Come to explore. On, how much longer? It's quite spacious here. Yep, this is our hub. You'll have plenty of everything here, except time. Now we're in the cold room. Here we store herbs, vegetables, and fish while the meat gets ground into portions for the animal rations. 
And right now we're running low on herbs and vegetables. Oh no. Got the hint? Get to it. You can find the instructions in your PDA. Oh. Low to herbal and vegetable. Okay. Thank you. Oh. <laughs> Fuck. We're off to a great start today, guys. Load two herbal and one vegetable bricks into the brick trolley. Things. Access. Notes. You planning to spend <sighs> the whole night on this? Tap. Hey, listen, buddy, buddy, look here, buddy. Why are you looking down at my camera? My eyes are up here. Damn. Vegetable. And then two herbal. Uh, I can only carry one at a time. Bro! I'm going to... I'm going to fuck him up. Because no way... No way are you going to rush me in doing my job. It's my first day. Right? Like, I understand it's the simplest task. Most of the bricks will be left as a reserve. And take these ones with you. It's time to show you our workhorse. What was that? There's something in the works that you're not ready to know about yet. Let's start with the basics. Okay. Uh-huh. Here's our K-A-T-I-E. Kinetic Automated Transport with Innovative Engineering. Katie will take you around the zoo. Did Tony Stark come up with that? This is the refrigeration compartment. You need to load the brick trolley here. Until you load it here, Katie won't budge. Oh, okay. To load the brick trolley, you need to activate the lever. Oh. Of course, because that makes sense. Aboard. Now, select the giraffe enclosure on the panel and start the train. The giraffe enclosure? There's so- What are you saying to me? There's so much happening right now. What is this used for? Sorry, I didn't- I don't think I got your name. All right. I mean, I'm going to call you yeah. Dave. All right, Doc, Doc, never mind, Doc. Giraffe, wallaby, gorilla, penguin, zebra, moose, hippopotamus, elephant, hub. Ah, I think I'll stay in the hub. I honestly think I'll stay in the hub, if that's okay with you. Wow. So we're at the giraffe station. Don't smile. Now listen carefully. I won't repeat it twice. This is our mobile veterinary station. Here you'll be mixing medications for our animals. Are they sick? Well, they can be. We need to closely monitor the health of the animals. We have some quite rare specimens, so the thought of anything happening to them is out of the question. Take this seriously, and we should all be safe for another day. Follow me. Oh, yes, sir. This is our kitchen factory. To collect feces for tests, you have to feed the animal its favorite food. Here's where you'll prepare it. Choose the recipe from the list. Cut, mix, and you're done. Any questions? Yes. Yes. Excellent. The <laughs> zoo needs those who aren't afraid to ask. But even more so, it needs those who find answers themselves. Uh, first question. Right, Why are we collecting feces? Yet. Go to the cutting table. You need to select the giraffe from the list. That makes sense. Herbal, vegetable. Click on the cut button to slice the herbs. Don't make a mistake with the weight. The exact measurement is displayed on the weight indicator. Oh my god, Measure what? Carefully. Need to cut what? Um so total weight is six kilograms, but I need three point five. So I would do like half. It's a little over half, right? Excellent, Paul. <laughs> Cut. Now do the same with the herbal brick from the recipe. Okay. So I need 1.5 here, so I do like about this much. The deviation is acceptable. Okay. Perfect. Now activate the lever to lower the gadget trolley. Uh. Yeah, I don't really think I want to work this job anymore, if I'm being honest. This isn't necessarily what I thought I was signing up for. The 
application, the, the online ad. <laughs> yeah. I never thought a zoo could be organized like this. A train? Trolleys? Yes, Paul, our zoo is quite unique. It's our pride. You won't see anything like it in others. Pride? Then why has the zoo been closed for the second year? People say the zoo is going through tough times. How would I know? I'm just a simple man. Clock in and clock out. How long have you been working here? Long enough to teach you everything. Come on, move the trolley. What does it look like I'm doing? This is the entrance to the enclosure. To open the door, you need to insert your PDA into the enclosure terminal and select open enclosure. I think I want to open the enclosure. Oh, Bo Po Cleo. <laughs> Who's naming these giraffes? Take the bucket and dump the food in the feeding area. Aww. So cute. Ah! Hi, Cleo. Oh my god. Oh, 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 I don't like. Oh, stop following me. Stop following me. Good god, stop following me. Where's the feeding area? Okay. Ah! <laughs> I know they're just regular giraffes right now, but no. Uh, dinner time, kids! I'm only seeing one. There's Cleo, Bo, and, uh... Oh, there's the other one. What's your name? Po. Uh, po looks extra sick. They all look extra sick. At least I assume that's what that yellow icon means. I don't have a stamina meter. It's over. Uh, oh, there you are. Great. Now put on the MFE. The what? What's that? Mobile Fecal Extractor. In simpler terms, a shit sucker. You've eaten shit before. <laughs> now you're going to suck it. <laughs> Why do we need all this? We need to constantly monitor the health of the animals. And taking excrement for tests is one of your key tasks. Yeah, that answered my question from earlier. A hundred thousand a year, Paul. A hundred thousand fucking American dollars. You just have to collect the shit. Come on, Paul. Don't chicken out. Oh. Okay, vacuum up feces. This is exactly what I want to do for the rest of my life. Everyone avert your eyes! It's gonna get gross! Uh, I hope you're not watching this while eating dinner or breakfast or lunch or really anything at all because this is disgusting. Ah, the sound effects too! I don't know either. I don't like the sound effects. I'm not a fan of the sound of that. Now take the TIS. To avoid unnecessary questions, it's a thermal imaging system. You can just call it a thermal imager. It's needed to determine the body temperature of our animals. Right, and that's where exactly? Good. Now install it and measure the temperature of the giraffes. Solid here? Measure the temperature of the giraffes. Oh, oh, okay, okay, I see, I see, I see. Okay. All right, hold on, I'll be RB. Okay, all right, all right. And what about you over here, big boy, girl? Big thing? Oh. You're feeling a little warm, aren't you? clean up after them in the morning. Some gadgets are still lying around on different stations and storage rooms. When you're there, grab those too. As you can see, one of the giraffes isn't doing well. We need to make a dart with Temperalax. It's a medication for normalizing the temperature of animals. By the way, it was developed by one of the local eggheads. Interact with the terminal and press the exit enclosure button. In the terminal, you can check all the anatomy. All right, take the trolley back to the train. Do I have to make some medications too? Well, you studied chemical technology in Indiana. You'll manage. Damn, how do you know all this? Trust me, it's not something worth being surprised about here. But I barely lasted six months there. Got picked out in the first year. No worries, that should be enough to mix a couple of ingredients following a ready-made formula. <laughs> they said you're good enough, you're hired. You know what this kind of reminds me of? This kind of reminds me of like, 
Choo Choo Charles in a way, I feel, because this guy is just here for introductory. And then <laughs> I have a feeling he's going to die, which leaves us to do the rest of the, you know what I'm saying? The rest of the job on our own. And then we got to pull. Ball, you've just come closer to success and the well-being of your family. Now, go and load the collected fecal matter into the biomaterial receiver. Oh, we're... Don't carry anything into the car. Everything must be sterile. And don't forget to put the shit sucker in its place. That's gross. That's so disgusting. Can I wash my hands? Can I, like, take a shower? Can I... Can I... Do you... Do we have a shower on board? Doc? 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 He's fine. He's he's okay. He'll be good. Everything's okay. Doc? What the hell? Ah! Why are you so jumpy? Now you need to load the trolley into the train. To do this, press the lever inside the car. <laughs> I wasn't scared. He just kind of popped up out of nowhere, too. It wasn't even like a real jump scare. He kind of just... This is our mobile vet station. To make temporal lax, you need to load the station with enough vials. I did it this time, but in the future, you'll have to gather the vials yourself to cook it up. Mm. But keep in mind, chum, there are not so many vials. Think twice before using them. Okay. I don't think I really caught that last part. What was that? Find thermal lax on the list. Or temper thermal lax. Create. Perfect. Now take the dart from the dart dispenser. Cool, you've got Temporalax. Now load it into the veterinary gun. It's in the gadget trolley. Gadget trolley, got it. Man, this thing has everything. Oh, I can't, I can't aim it at Doc, no! Ah, come on, give me some liberty of freedom, some creative freedom. Okay, so now I shoot the giraffe. Yes? Wait, I don't think I've loaded it. Good. Now the only thing left is to dart the sick giraffe. Hmm. Okay. That should be easy. Uh. Sick giraffe, Paul. Be careful. Don't confuse Bo with Po. <laughs> so it's Poe that I need to shoot. Got it. Which one are you, Bo? Which one are you, Poe? Right in the ass. <laughs> <laughs> that was perfect. <laughs> right in the ass. Yeah, aside from the feces, this job is pretty damn easy. Storage. Access denied. Doc, I did it! De I, Doc! I shot Poe right in the ass. Doc! So everything went smoothly? Hell yeah. Seems like it. I did this for the first time. Hopefully he'll get better soon. Well, don't doubt that. We need to get back to the hub. Okay. Return to the hub. Yeah, this job is simple enough. Again, aside from the feces, I'm fine. Let's go, Paul. Escort me to the exit. It's yes. time to leave you alone with our lovely zoo facility. I don't know if I want to be left alone, honestly. You think you could uh show me around like the rest of the zoo? Like the the other animals? Yeah, no, I'll come with you. Vital box. Okay. Oh. I don't think I should be taking any of that right now. Doc? Every zookeeper is entitled to a service car. This one's mine. If oh. you perform well tonight, you'll get one in the morning. <laughs> I was like, that's my whip? Should I tell her you're staying here for the night? Keep in mind, I'll lock you in until morning. That sounds no like a problem. threat. I think she'll figure it out and go home soon. As you wish. Good luck, Paul. Don't mess up. Hmm. Hmm. Not sure about this. New access added. All right. How long ago? You're not answering calls. I'm worried. 
Uh, what? Lily, sweetheart. Sorry. Didn't hear you right away. Everything's okay. They put me on probation, but I had to start immediately. You should just go home. I'll be back in the morning and tell you everything. Paul, but I saw them lock you up. It's not normal. Yeah, it's just protocol here. They took away my phone and made me sign an NDA. And all I have to do is feed and treat the animals. Oh, uh, and by the way, uh, there's plenty of meat here. I want my girls to finally eat normal food. I'll be right back. Don't go away. Put a meat brick for Lily in the parcel drop box. Uh, what? Where on earth do I get that? Brick trolley. Oh, I can sprint with this? Let's go! That doesn't make me uneasy at all. Meat. Take it to my lovely wife. Should I be feeding her this? I don't, I really don't think. I feel like this is just specifically for the animals. Lily, are you here? Yeah. Take this. Give Gina a kiss from daddy. It's time for me to work. Something seems a little fishy about that one. Definitely shouldn't be feeding them that kind of food, but okay. All right, um, let's see. Check the enclosure, feed animals, collect analysis, measure the temperature, measure the sound. Sound? Nobody said anything about a sound. Submit blood for analysis, submit fe feces for analysis. I don't think I got any of that. Seems I'll have to manually record the symptoms of zucosis, scars, and mucus. Probably I will need all of these things for work. I wonder what will happen if I apply them just not just on animals. Okay, okay, all right. These are all of my objectives up until this point. Blood collector. I didn't, nobody said anything about blood. All right, what enclosure should we go to first? Ooh, we got the wallaby, the gorilla, the penguin. Let's go visit, let's go visit the wallaby. Now, we have to select the wallaby. Hook. And then we need two. Oh, I see. So I'm gonna wanna cut about, can I just cut about this much? And then Okay, so I didn't cut enough off of that one. And I'm gonna wanna cut half of this. I wish it would tell you the exact measurements that you... This deviation is acceptable. Okay. Okay. Ooh, and the fact that I can't turn around while I'm doing this either is like really uncomfortable. Hello? Night zookeeper, Paul Connolly. Oh, thank God, finally. Uh, please don't hang up. I've been trying to reach my husband all day. He's a scientist, Clarence J. Summers. Oh. People usually call him CJ. I'm sorry, ma'am. I'm here alone. Please check for me. He should be in the lab. Uh, is there a lab here? Oh, I understand. You're new. Then, one last request. Look in his locker in the break room. Code 1768. Ma'am. This doesn't feel right. Paul, I'm begging you. CJ needs to take his medication regularly. I just want to make sure he has them with him. Just open the locker. That's all. I'll call back. All right. 1768. I put that down in the notes on my phone just in case. I'm not sure if I should help this woman. I already have enough problems as it is. Yeah, okay. So they didn't write down the code for me, so it's kind of a good thing. Oh, she just coded one sentence. Damn it! All right, well, thanks for making it easy on me, game. I would have had it myself, but, you know. Say lobby. Oh, is this a locker? No, it is not. Anthony Hopwood. I just saw something horrible. I shot lethal dart. But one wasn't enough. It took around 300 milliliters, but it worked. Fuck, it worked. I'm alive. Anthony, what's your ass talking about? 
Anyways, back to my job. Should I... Yeah, you know what? I'll finish the job first, and then I'll go check on that locker. Is this what a wallaby is supposed to sound like? Penny, Sally, Amy, Wally. Okay, all right. Hiya, you guys. Oh, aren't you the cutest? Aren't you the just most adorablest things I've ever seen? Eat up, it's chow time. Amy, are you not going to go eat your food, sweetie? Oh, I'll pet an animal for the first time. Oh, is there an achievement to pet all the animals? I don't think I'm gonna do that, but uh, you know. Okay, so then that's the dart gun, that's the TIS, UV flashlight, ASSA, blood syringe. Wait, nobody said anything about any of these other things. I thought I was just collecting feces and calling it a day. Feces? More feces? I need more shit. Oh! This is the, the tasks that I need to do for... Okay. Alright, alright. So I do need to submit feces samples. I don't know if I've collected all their samples. But I think this might be enough? Question mark. So I'm just going to put this back. And then I need to measure the temperature. I'll take this thing. Oh my god. You really don't seem to be doing well. No, stop fighting! I need to scan the temperatures! Move, Penny! Sally, no! Come back, Sally, no! Oh, God! Oh, I thought this job was supposed to be easy! No, stop moving! Stop moving! Stop moving! Oh. Alright, just, just sit still. For one second, for one goddamn second, can you sit still? Please, 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 Sally, please, please. Oh, thank goodness. Alright, I just need one more. No. Wait, what? Which one? Oh, did I get all the temperatures? So now I need to get sound. So how do I measure the sound? I wanna say it's this one. Ah, okay, this job is easy. Hold on. Oh, there's some more feces over there. Penny, stay still! Oh, you're the little troublemaker, aren't you? Perfect. Thank you, Penny. Heal the animals. I haven't finished all my tasks. There's some more shit samples I gotta collect. I gotta submit blood samples now. Does that mean I have to... I gotta stick these things. Blood syringe. Oh, thank you for making that easy. Oh my god, thank you for making that easy. Wow, you know what? This just might be the easiest job I've ever worked as a YouTuber. Can I not? Why can I not? I probably only need the one blood sample, maybe? Okay, I don't know. We'll find out. I'll take this stuff back to the, uh, to the trolley. Yeah, because these aren't, these aren't doing the thing. Task complete. Okay, now I gotta submit the blood samples, however I'm supposed to.
blood collect. Okay. So I still need to collect the blood of two more of the wallabies. Well, shit! Give me your blood, Penny! How am I supposed to... Oh, do you have to pet them first? What the hell is happening? Man, it's just going straight through her head. I must be missing. I've got to be missing something. Because if I take the blood from Amy and Sally, that doesn't count for Wally and Penny. But it's not letting me take the blood samples for either of them. Oh, wait, wait, wait. How to take blood? Apparently, blood can only be taken from an animal in its stationary state. Well, yeah. Obviously. But th th that doesn't help me. Because I knew that already. You can't take blood from them while they're moving. But here's the problem with that is that one the they weren't moving and I still couldn't take the blood. So is there like some kind of dart that I can use to keep to make it stop moving? Should I use a tranquilizer to take the blood or do I? I feel like I don't need this. But I'll take it, I think. I feel like I shouldn't have wasted that new message. I sent you a parcel with vitals of the active substance. I think you'll find this useful. You'll find them in the parcel box. See, because Wally is just sitting here. Why? Wally, Wally's literally not doing anything. I think my game is bugged. I think that's what it is. Because leave it up to me to get the buggy games. Okay, now I can take blood from Wally. I just had to restart the game. Not all the way from the beginning, thankfully. Just enough so that I can get Wally to not be bugged anymore. So I didn't need that tranquilizer, which means that I just wasted the ingredients to make it. Fuck. Unless I didn't waste it. No, I still got it. Ha ha! I've outsmarted you, game! Oh, that's a nice moon. Okay, heal the animals. Now... How do I know what I need? Sepsis is a dangerous condition caused by infection leading to tissue damage, organ failure, and death. Plague. <laughs> like this, select a symptom. Oh, I think. Migraine. Migraine is a neurological condition causing severe headaches with nausea and okay, that might be what we need. Something for a migraine. Treatment for migraine. Oh, I wasted it on the tranquilizer. Shit. Where do I get more of that? Do I have a converter? Can I turn... Can I convert the tranquilizer stuff back to its original form? God damn it. I'm going back because I remembered this stuff was here. Yeah. So now that... 100 milliliters. That's exactly what I needed. Required for making the dart. Can I close that now? Yeah, while I'm here, I'll also check the locker as well. There's a floppy disk on the floor. There's a floppy disk on the floor. Mm hmm. Testing experimental meds on mutated specimens. They don't work during the frustration phase. The pathological cell division process must be completed. In other words, the organism must fully mutate. Access the experimental drugs. Access to the experimental drugs is located at the vet station. Uh, that must be the virus. I'm so confused. Animal blood. I collected that already. Do I have to go back and collect their blood again? Oh my god! Okay. This better... Okay. Alright. Okay. Parasite. For eliminating the parasite, mimicking migraine. That is what I need, right? Select a symptom filter to find the disease. 
So I select the sound, and then if it's just sound, migraine, okay. All right, so it's supposed to just be a migraine. This is all I need. Did I get her? I think I got it. Oh, hey guys, I um, I made the wrong treatment. I was supposed to make the neuro shield, but I ended up making the uh, cephalotrigus toxica, and I don't know where else I'm supposed to get more phyto. So, uh... man, I really think they should just let you make this stuff. I. Do I have to start the game over from the beginning now? Where else would I get more of this stuff? Okay, I went ahead and I restarted the whole game. Uh, I did find that you can actually find vials of everything that you need for crafting. They're kind of just sprawled out. And this game is actually randomized because I found out that I actually did have to use the tranquilizer this time because Wally and Penny would not sit still. They got scared every time I got close, so I couldn't collect blood until I used the tranquilizer to put them to sleep. That way I then could collect the blood from them. And now they have diseases with uh, sound and blood. So we need we need something to cure leptos, lepto, leptospirosis. Leptospirosis is a bacterial infection transmitted through water contaminated with animal urine. Ew. Okay. Leptocirrhosis. So I have to read carefully and pay attention to what this is a treatment for. Treatment for acute substance for the treatment of leptocirrhosis. Okay. So you see how I have 600 and 500 milliliters of this stuff? That's because I just happened to randomly find a bunch of vials of this. So if I craft it, this should be what I need. And we should be able to make our way. I only need, I only made one? I need two. I need two of this. Now it's time to care some animals. Oh, I really hope that I didn't miss that one. Hey, there we go. Fucking finally. Check the next enclosure. It shouldn't have taken me as long as it did to actually finish that. That was just one animal enclosure out of like eight of them. I've been recording for two hours. I also did go back and I, yeah. Night Zookeeper, Paul Connolly. I'm sorry, ma'am. I haven't had a chance to look around yet. What's with the ma'am? Uh-oh. Oh, nothing. A woman called, looking for someone named CJ, searching for her husband. That bitch again. Although CJ's no saint either, always hanging around some girls, lying to his wife that he's in the lab, and we don't even have labs here. Anyway, forget it. Why am I calling you? There'll be a food delivery soon, and you need to grind some fresh meat. Got it? Yes, sir. Mm. Excellent. I'll call you later. I don't know. Something about that's kind of fishy. Return to the hub and activate the supply lever. Is this... Okay. Have I been injected with some stuff? Should I return to the hub first or can I go to the other enclosures? Ah, I'll return to the hub first. Seemed kind of important. When I tell you that it took me way longer to get through one enclosure than it should have. That's where the nudity comes from. Okay. I was like, why the hell would there be nudity in a game about infected zoo animals? But that makes more sense. Hello? Damn. I, I mean, Night Zookeeper, Paul Connolly. Don't worry, Paul. It's me again. How's it going? Do you need any explanations? Oh, I definitely do. I thought you had beef or, I don't know, lamb in the fridge. And there... And there's a long neck pig. You see, Paul, dozens of parasites spread from the mother every day. 
They infiltrate our animals and they turn into, how shall I put it? Well, monsters. And they have specific tastes. They need meat. What the? What the hell is the mother? <laughs> Relax. The mother is securely locked away. Not much is known about her, so they study her. Forget about it. You know your tasks. Don't worry about the rest. Fuck! I gave a piece of meat to my wife. You did what? <laughs> Sorry, Paul, but it's really ridiculous. Life gives you a chance to become a worthy, well-off person, and you take the easy way. Descending to simple theft. There won't be any more indulgence. So if they say grind bodies, you grind. They'll say kill, you kill. Got it? Got it. Just tell me where my phone is. I'll call Lily. Maybe she and Gina haven't eaten yet. I won't allow it, chum. If you call your wife, it'll be a direct violation of the NDA. No, Paul, you won't drag me into this. You'll have to fully feel the consequences of your misdeed. And now stop whining and go to work. Damn. Damn. Okay. Feed infected animal. New. All right. All right. Got it. I've given you access to the recipes for the infected specimens in the kitchen factory. Feed them. Wow. Well, that is no fun at all. No, no, no. I did end up grabbing a bunch of vegetables and herbs before I went on my expedition. Because I thought I'd just be going to enclosure. She's still alive. She's still alive. I thought she was dead. Hello? The night zookeeper, Paul Connolly. Why so grim? Problems? Yeah! Ugh, what the hell is going on here? Fuck. I almost threw a live girl into the grinder. Where did she come from? Alive? Well, well. 20 milozylazine and she's still with us. But fortunately, this problem is easy to solve. Pull the drop lever and the girl will turn into a couple of bricks, just like you've dealt with before. Easy peasy. Fuck! I suspected this place wasn't clean, but uh, why else such big bucks? I can grind a couple of bodies, but I'm not going to get involved in crime and risk my family. Fuck you. Well, no one is asking you. <laughs> in general. Look at your hands. What the hell is this? Oh! Did you poison me? Ooh, ooh, poison? Ooh, <laughs> ooh. Who do you think I am? A desperate housewife? Ooh. No, Paul. I infected you. And by the way, I did it for your own good. You see dozens of parasites spread out of the mother every day. They infiltrate our animals and they transform, to put it mildly. Well, let's say they mutate. What the hell is this damn mother? <laughs> Not much is known about her, so they study her. But right now, the same parasite is squirming inside you. And if you behave well, they'll take it out. And if not, who knows? Maybe it will be even better for Lily and Gina. Fuck! Okay, well, I guess duty calls. I'm so sorry, ma'am. She made a lot of meat bricks. I believe this is what I'm supposed to do. Plop. I've given you access to uh -huh. feed them. Feed infected animal. Uh, where? Okay, my next assumption is that I have to get back on the trolley and by access, they mean uh, access to a different enclosure, which is how we'll Encounter our first infected animal. No? Check the enclosure, feed the animals, collect analysis, measure the temperature, pair the meat, feed the infected animal. What animal is the infected animal? Infected animal recipes are available. Oh. Should I be going to these enclosures then? There, this game doesn't give you a whole lot of instruction. 
I guess we'll move on to the gorilla. I'm not quite sure where I need to find the infected uh, specimen, but the gorilla is where we go. We'll just work our way up. Task is updated. I can't even click on that. Gorilla! Gorilla! Oh, I should I probably should have saved the gorilla for last. Hmm, why do I have to go downstairs for the storage? Oh, more Anthony. More, uh, Anthony shit. I finally found a way to cure that damn mutant with the experimental meds. I found access on C on some CJ's PDA. Looks like he's an important dude around here. He gave the mutant an injection of toxic, toxicus, toxic, toxicus, feralus, and this shit really worked. Awesome news. And by the way, it seemed mutants can mimic different diseases. I'll keep an eye on that. All right. When they turn, the meat can calm them down. What do you mean when they turn? What do you mean when they turn? I mean, I, I know that they're supposed to turn, but are you saying that the normal ones will turn? <laughs> okay. All right. Hi, you guys. Excuse me. Pardon me. Excuse me. Just gotta, just gotta get through. Okay. Here's some slop. There's your food. See, I don't, I don't trust this because gorillas, as far as I know, are very territorial creatures. Um, <laughs> okay. I just gotta wait for them to take a shit. Oh my god, this is the worst thing. I I hate this job. I really hate this job more than you know, actually. More than you can know. You know, if I have to sit here and and deal with this, so do you. I'm not cutting this out. You and I. <laughs> god. It's the worst, because it's like... Oh, you're just watching them do their business. And then you have to hear the slur... Uh, okay. Alright, I got the shit, I got the sound. I, I fed them. Oh my god, that's the worst. Oh. Oh. I was like, where the hell did they go? I didn't know that they had an upper part of the enclosure. Sorry, don't mind me. I'm just gonna scan your temps. Chief Dexter Thor and what was the other one's name? Uh, uh, hold on, hold on. Don't tell me. Don't tell me. It was. It was. It was. It was Pepper. I knew it started with a P. I wanted to say Penny, but that was one of the uh, one of the Wallabies. All right, you guys are laxed. I could... Should I pet you? I definitely shouldn't do that. He's gonna bite my face off. They are so chill about getting injected. These animals are better than regular children. Humans, as a matter of fact. Some of us humans can't even handle the smallest of needles. Now I must cure my animal friends. What if what if there's nothing wrong with any of them? I mean, obviously that's not how the game works cuz there's got to be something wrong with one of them. Okay. So if blood is just the issue, then we need 
BSI, something to cure BSI. BSI is a condition where bacteria or other pathogens enter the bloodstream causing serious illness. So crafting something for BSI. Substance for treatment of blood diseases. That might be it. B guard. See, because none of those explicitly said be cure for like BSI or anything like that. So I, I kind of just assumed that since it's a blood disease, we would need something like that for a blood disease. Which... Handle the mutant- oh shit. Am I gonna die? Um... I need something to feed it, right? I need to be able to feed the mutant gorilla. Okay, all right, okay. Um, nobody trained me for what to do about this. I just know that I have food that I can make for the gorilla. <laughs> okay, okay, uh, food. I, I would assume that the gorilla needs food. This is so off-putting. What the hell? Okay, let's try to feed it first, I think. What exactly am I, what's the object? Rescue the Dexter, rescue the Pepper, rescue the Thor. I think my priorities are a little not straight here. No. No. How am I supposed to rescue them? What the fuck? Um, how am I supposed to rescue Dexter and and Yo, they give you no instructions for this game. They just dump you in and say, "Good luck. You got this, big dog." Do I make the lethal injection? That sounds about right. First, I need to use the B guard on Or actually, should I use a lethal injection? Yeah, I think I got Thor. Where's the infected one? Like, I hear it growling, but I do not see it. Oh. See, I definitely would have died. Are you bugged out too? I swear to God, if that's the case. Oh shit. Okay, okay, it's going to eat now. didn't help at all it still got three hearts I mean two. Oh, never mind it's got one. Oh, it's dark now that isn't good at all no I missed the fucking shot! You're kidding! Ah! Wait, I got it? Oh, why does it say task complete? Oh my god, I missed the fucking shot! I panicked! Are you gonna attack again? Oh my 
goodness. Does it need more food? It's got plenty of food. I'm not... I don't understand why it just bugs out after, like, the first kill. Um... That's horrible. I shouldn't laugh at that. Okay, what do I do now? Do I need a free hand? Hold on, I'll be back for you. I'm so confused. We've delivered some fresh meat. Head to the hub and deal with it. So that, that was it then? That was it? I mean... genuinely never been more confused in my life they don't prepare you for anything they didn't tell you that you needed the lethal injector i mean i guess it's kind of obvious if you're reading the notes but like there's no enclosure to close anymore this is actually kind of wild so do i have to do that for all the animals i also don't really need a fresh supply of meat i've got plenty of meat Coming to grab some fish. Because I'm heading to the penguin enclosure next. Yay! We love penguins. The bio waste filter is clogged. What the hell does that mean? No comment about that. Nothing. No comment. A hand. A hand just fell out of the bio waste filter and we had no comment about it. I mean, I guess we literally just had to grind up a woman, a live woman, and then our, our boss told us not to worry about it. So I don't think that's the weirdest thing that we've seen tonight, but just like, no, oh man, this job just keeps getting weirder and weirder. None of that. I love penguins. Little fun fact about me, penguins used to be my favorite animal when I was younger. This is what I absolutely love about my job is the back and forth. When's that lady gonna call? She's bound to call again, right? Another Anthony Hopwood. Uh, damn, something strange is happening to me. An overwhelming urge to eat this raw meat. My hand grabbed a piece on its own and I devoured it almost without chewing. That sweet taste in my mouth. Yeah. Buddy's off the deep end. But you know what? That's none of my business. I'm just here to do my job, get my money, feed my family. Let's see how many penguins I have to kill. I mean, fix. Daisy, Luna, Coco, Tinker, Misty, Rocky. Jesus Christ. Right, grab the bucket. Grab the shit thing. The shit sucker. Uh, it's f f f freezing in here. Where's the feeding area? Feeding time, children! Eat up, eat your slop. I'll check their sound first. It's the easiest thing to do while they're eating.
Okay, I got all their sound. Now I just gotta wait for them to start dropping deuces. Um, I will get their temps next. Everybody should be at a decent temperature. It's about cold as hell in here. I don't know why I wasn't given the proper equipment to go into this room. Oh, you guys are warm. I think you are actually way too warm for penguins. Cool. Now I gotta suck up some shit. Not a sentence I thought I'd be saying. Did everybody eat? No, everybody did not eat. EAT YOUR SOUP! Well, I guess while I wait on that, I will get some blood samples. Oh, they're all just sleepy babies. They're all just chilling. Every animal but the wallabies has made the blood samples easy for me. Look at them, aren't they all just the cutest things? I can't remember whose blood samples I got, so I'm just gonna have to take what I got and then submit feces, submit blood. Did I feed them all already? Oh, I guess I did. Okay. Uh, so I'm gonna submit the feces and the blood that I've got and then come back to get the ones that I didn't get. Oh, you guys have temps. You guys have really bad temperatures. We can't have that. Not for our little penguins. We must protect the penguins at all costs. If we lose a single penguin, I'm gonna be pissed. Oh, shit. The gorillas are fine. We can lose one gorilla because again, I didn't exactly know what I was doing in that situation. I mean, I had it right, but I missed the bullet because I, ah, I'm so pissed about missing the goddamn bullet. We could have saved them all. We could have rescued all the animals. Okay, whose blood do we still need to collect? We still need... Misty was the only one. I missed an opportunity to scan or to take Misty's blood. Because she had... She was literally the last penguin that was like sleeping. I didn't take her blood. I'm coming for you, Misty. Papa's coming to collect some blood. Don't worry, my sweet. Oh, fuck. Damn it. I didn't get Missy's blood. Ah! Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. I gotta craft the lethal, the lethal company. Assuming that this penguin also has three health. Papa's coming for you, penguins. Oh, is my aim gonna have to be on point for this one? Or are you gonna land at some point? Got it! Whoa, whoa, whoa! Okay, all right. My aim doesn't have to be on point, I just have to watch for when it's about to strike. I got it. Woo! Didn't let a single penguin die. Now, if you'll excuse me, sweetie. Uh, Misty, I need to collect your blood. I know that was a very exciting moment for everybody. I know we're all super tired. Uh, um, Misty? Misty, dearie. Papa needs to collect your blood. Where the hell is she at? Oh, was Misty the one... Misty was the one that I had to... What? Is this Misty? I think that might have been Misty. Yeah, because I don't have a blood sample from her. Before leaving, make sure all the blood... All the samples are detected. Well, I definitely didn't do that. I'm gonna get fired. So does that mean I just can't... Okay. All right. Um, well, I'm gonna go make the cure for you guys. 
This game is low key kind of confusing. I, so would she have turned? Would Missy have turned if I had gotten her blood samples? Oh, uh, you guys are just making it easy on me. It's a good thing penguins sleep so much. Am I right, guys? Oh, so that was our Misty. Oh, no. If only I had collected her blood sample sooner. There I go, vomiting again. Yeah, I'm dead. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die before the night is over. I think I have to go back to the wallaby and giraffe section. So that I can, um, save them as well. Because I've already cured them. But I haven't taken out the infected animals. I'm gonna go ahead and make lethal injections. That's why they give you so much of that stuff. In case you need to make a whole bunch. I need my dart gun and my bale. Boom! Right? Boom! No? Is there no infected wallaby here? Cured all the animals. Walla babies! I guess there's no infected wallaby. Uh, okay. Well, I don't know what I'm supposed to do with this waste, so I'm just gonna kind of dump it in here. I guess feel free to eat it if you want. But you don't have to. I was very much expecting to have a guest here. This is kind of awkward. No boom for the giraffe either? Okay, well, it's a good thing I didn't make food for the giraffe. How do I progress? I'm supposed to head back to the hub? I think I'm supposed to head back to the hub. Hey, Paul. Are you here? Lily? Oh, yeah, no, I'm tripping. The meat you gave me was incredibly delicious. <clears throat> Gina had three servings. <clears throat> and I promised to take the rest to her beloved daddy. Oh, someone arrived. Hello. Do you work here? Hey, what are you doing? Let me go! <laughs> Good morning, Paul. How was your night? It's time to feed the mother. Wake up, Paul. Mother likes her food to flutter and squeak. Don't worry about your wife. I think she'll make a great dessert. Really, Paul, you didn't think that after everything you've seen, I'd let you go. Uh-oh, looks like Mommy is particularly hungry today. Goodbye, Paul. Tell Mother, bon appetit. <laughs> Paul didn't save the journalist. He failed to warn Lily about the origin of the meat and her visit with a meal made from a from it became fatal. Lily fell into Doc's trap just like Paul. Both of them became food for this monster for this monster. The young daughter Gina was left an orphan. What? 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 Continue plus. What? Okay, I don't know if this is a game with like multiple endings. I mean, obviously that made it seem like there were multiple endings. But, huh. Okay. Well, that was Zucosis. If you wanted to see more Zucosis, leave a like and let me know down in the comments below if you want to see more Zucosis, because apparently there's more Zucosis. Zucosis is a fun game. It is an interesting game. Once you actually get the hang of what you're supposed to do, it doesn't hold your hand, but it also doesn't make anything easy. <laughs> it's not too hard, but it's not too easy. It's only hard if you just, you're really not sure what you're doing. I wonder, what is Continue Plus? I'm actually just kind of curious.
He was zooming. So how was I supposed to warn her? How was I supposed to warn her about the food? Or was there a way that I could have not done that? Okay, so this cuts off the enclosure for all of the other animals and then opens up for the zebra, the moose, the hippopotamus, and the elephant. So I wonder if that gives me a different ending. I don't know. Anyways, uh, I'm going to leave it off here. If you guys want to see more Zucosis, uh, we can definitely come back to this and rescue the last four animals. Maybe we could start over a new game and then try and see if we can get some other stuff. I don't... I really don't know. I... <laughs> <laughs> we'll definitely have to come back to this though. Subscribe if you're new. Come join the family. 1K before GTA 6 definitely should be a possibility. I'm just saying. We don't even have a release date for the game, but I do think that uh, that we can get it before. <laughs> like the video if you enjoyed it. Comment what your favorite animal is down in the comments. I don't know. Just trying to get to know you guys. If you want to see my most recent video, I'll have that link somewhere around here. And then I'll have YouTube recommend whatever you watch next also linked somewhere around here. I'm going to get out of here. I love you guys. Stay safe out there. Take it easy. And big buddy out. Poor gorilla. <laughs>